Greetings, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Sim Airport. Better H here with you. Sorry about missing last week. Unfortunately, it couldn't be avoided. Oh, my goodness. Well, we are, uh... We are putting it on, aren't we? We're, we're getting close to the point where we can start offering baggage service for some of these gates, which is awesome. Of course, we got to get out of the red first. Now we're getting folks in and ready to go. Our first class folks are rotating through. Everybody's coming in and out, rolling through our special areas. Hoping we get a nice positive flow here. Otherwise, this is going to be real short. <laughs> We have an inactive runway, that's not helping. So yeah, we're starting to get some some money in place. What we really need to do is we need to have about uh, uh, thirty thousand or so in the bank, so we can finish off the road here. Because we're going to put our hangar over here, and then we can start buying the actual baggage carts we need to uh, make this work. starting to get there, but again, you, we're going to lose so much money overnight, as we do. I don't want to be doing anything until we have a positive, you know, 1 a.m. total, right? that we'll have our large 10 um,
Not too bad, considering the fact we started off the day in a $17,000 hole. So we'll have to see where we're at today. Come midnight, everybody leaves. But the expenses continue. Our inventory comes at a cost, right? And all that starts to happen. And that's part of why I wanted to wait. So now we'll look at B building a road here. balance continues to drop until our first airplanes will arrive and then we'll get a we'll get the bonus back up again and uh, that should be enough I think to get us the last couple of bits of road we need right And we need to get that medium hangar built. Oh, $28,650 for that, right? So, yeah, we're going to have to wait a little bit on the medium hangar, I'm afraid. <laughs> Although I'm wondering if we don't build a small hangar here and then just on the side get one thing going and maybe slip it for two two of the gates just for now and then eventually we'll end up using that for either a fuel truck or catering or something to that effect. Maybe that's maybe that's the way we go with it here. Let's let's take a look at that. Um, object structures, small hangar. We've got enough money for it.
Then we'll get our base cache out of the, uh... Out of the rest of the, um, grant that we've signed up for way back when, right? So we've got that done, now we need to get the rest of the conveyor belt system built. Objects is... We're starting to send packages down. Already? <laughs> As ticketing works. Let's take a look at our admin and then probably going to need to sign one more sales rep once we get the money to get our airline interest above negative again first thing in the morning that's okay we're gonna get this up and running and then we should keep your fingers crossed actually have everything ready to go Come on. Our poor baggage cart's working overtime to get things he needs done done. But he's making it work all right. And 
star flight gets a third rep. And as he starts to work them, they'll start to get happier. <laughs> We should get that above his passengers and they're boarded and gone and as you can see they're met quickly baggage is unloaded rapidly taken over going to unload the passengers and we've still got a little bit of time left. Hurry, 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 get that baggage loaded. <laughs> no, not all the baggage are loaded. Why aren't all the bags loaded? Did they not get there in time, I wonder? Is there a problem in the bag system? Seems to be everything working all right. It goes directly to the carousel that it's supposed to go to. Hmm. Well, I'm not certain why that's uh, monkeyed up, that one, but... He's getting the bags loaded back on, and we'll move them back in back into place we're still at 69 percent oh my goodness no okay uh, I think what we're gonna need to end up doing here is hmm possibly ex expanding this area here that I was going to keep for offices or build a separate area for the for the uh, staff there for um, meetings it may be down to that But we're going to have to wait for that for next time. We at least have our functioning baggage we're working on a couple of gates. We're going to get the rest of the this side there put together, I think. Well, I have to have two carts for three gates. ought to be perfectly fine. And then we will go from there and get our airline satisfaction up to a whopping 70%. Although I don't know where my other sales rep is. Maybe that's the problem. I do not see the I do not see the third office. Um, and maybe that's our problem. I don't know why, but perhaps that's our problem. Now, you know, now I'm curious to see if there's something going on there, right? So let's see. That's got a it has no rep. No Connect, Starflight, and Pacific Airlines. I 
I think you'd think that our arrow time would have a rep, right? So let's give him the one from Starflight. Because he's got the most flights scheduled. And then a Ford Air ought to have one because he's got the next one. Arrow time, a Ford Air, and either Atlantic or Starflight. I think Atlantic. So yeah, so dump the one from Pacific. Pacific needs to go over to... Atlantic. And I'm thinking that ought to start getting our numbers up to the point where, you know, just maybe, just maybe we'll have enough flights and airlines working here that have people come in there that think, hey, maybe maybe we can send somebody there, right? Hire another one for Aerostar, maybe? Well, that's going to have to be next time, folks. And until then, if you've enjoyed today's episode, despite its sudden lengthy extra couple of minutes, please consider liking, subscribing, thumbs up, comments, best thing. And uh, we'll see you back next time on another episode of Sim Airport. Until then, take care, everybody. Be kind to one another out there. <laughs>